looking forward to this one tonight. Gretzky's gained possession inside the neutral zone. Pokes the puck away. Scooped up along the wall by Gretzky. Slides the puck down low. From the blue line, they take control of it. Oh, just a great heads-up play by Lawrence. Florida's got a hold of the puck. Quick feed to Kearns. Florida's moving it along the wing. And he takes the pass. Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. Oh, my goodness, it stayed out. What a save. what he means to this team. Edmonton's been pushing hard here early in this first period, and look at that. Their hard work pays off with a goal. Uh, there's so many mini-games within a game, James, and to start the period, you can look at it as one. And they have certainly dominated in that area. And when you start the game like this, you dictate the pace, and that's exactly what they wanted to do, and send a strong message to their away opponent that when you come into our barn, you're not going away with W. the net and the lanes clogged up blocking that big punch getting closer to the halfway point of this frame Edmonton's got a two goal lead they'd love to build on it Gretzky's quick stick lands him the puck here at center sent into the offensive zone assisted by number 87 the Oilers have had multiple scoring opportunities here in this first and could easily have a much bigger lead. Marcus Trot, quick shot. Oh, the air mailed it right over the net. Oh, yeah, an opportunity lost here, James. He sees the daylight at the top of the net and he just sails it high. Sherman's moving the puck through his own zone. From the open ice, they gain the line. Moves it quickly over to Lawrence. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. Edmonton's been working hard away from the puck, and they're using their awareness to take away angles and seams. And this is something they're doing with their stick positioning. Coach talked about it pregame, how important it was going to be. Coughs it up on the play. The Panthers have it now. Takes the feed. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Here we go, odd man rush here. Puts it on net, denied by the goaltender. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Gives them nothing in front. Here's a rip, takes a shot. Oh, what a club save there. More than half the period has expired. Edmonton's got a 2-0 lead. Marcus drop, we're back under a quick shot. Edmonton's gonna play it from the corner. One possession. The Panthers take possession here in the open ice. Now a quick pass to Sherman. Florida's going on the attack as they gain the zone. The Oilers have it from their own end. They've got the defense outnumbered. Edmonton's got it along the wall. And that's turned aside by Schneider. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. The Oilers have been handed two for interference. The Panthers get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. First power play opportunity for this team. It's going to start in the face-off circle, getting possession with the win, and then looking to set up. Here's a shot. Oh, and it just gets a piece of it to keep it out. 48 seconds. Cutting to the front of the net. How did he stop that one? Well, that was a necessary stop on their emotional leader, James. And if he had put that puck in the net, it would have created an energy that would have been hard to stop. Of this power play, they're ready to drop the puck 
here for this face-off. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. And there's the save. Play blown dead, let's get the call. The Oilers will have to serve two in the box. Goaltender interference is the call. Florida's got a five on three and lots of time on their side. Power play chance right here and an opportunity to redeem themselves after that shorty they gave up earlier. Gets it out of his own end. Mahomes explores his options in the corner. And it's a quick pass to Quarles. That's not going to fool him. Puck moved over to Martinez. Tosses it on to Hyde. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. To his teammate, denies him. Uncle Larry's made himself look big on that save and almost made it look easy. That's a high shooting percentage shot because it's coming from a great A scoring area. Shot makes the save. Boucher's back out onto the ice and they will continue to play shorthanded here. And they get that puck down the ice. And the Tendy steps out to play it. Well, look at this, Cheryl. Here we go. The parade is officially underway. It certainly is. And everyone in the building, you can hear the crowd just jeering with their frustration, including everyone on the bench, completely deflated right now. A non-stop procession to the penalty box for the home team. Less than a minute to go here in the opening frame. And he had the answer on that play. Sometimes goaltenders just make it look easy, James. And look at how big he makes himself in the net as he's trying to track and find the puck at all costs. It almost looks easy for him, but that's an impressive save. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Grabbed along the board by Messier. Easily turned aside by Bobrovsky. McDonald's out of the box, but they're still shorthanded as he steps in to help try to kill off this penalty. Fantastic save! And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Slides it across to Kearns. Here's a shot, and he hangs on just as time runs out. 20 minutes in the books. Let's grab a breather, and we'll come back with period number two in moments. Fans back in their seats. Teams are on the ice. They're ready to drop the puck here for period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. He scores! And does he ever! You know what's amazing, James? Every time he scores, it's like the entire bench elevates. Why? Because he is a leader on this team. He shows it on the ice and, of course, by example, off of it. Florida's got to find a way to build on this now. This is the time. It certainly is, James, and that's something to build off when you get a goal. You can't sit idly by like you have all game. You have to find a way to execute and create some momentum and more offense if they want to get back in the game. Edmonton's penalty killers get a hold of it. McDonald's got it in the defensive end. Skates to the crease. Wow, that power play needs to manage the puck better. Puck is dropped, play resumes. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Florida's got the puck against the boards. Made the stop on the play. Well, this is an uncharacteristic miss for him. I mean, he typically makes good on this shot and gives his team a boost in the arm. Not today, though. Goalie shuts the door. Pass back to the point. Makes the save with the trapper. Through center along the wing. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. Picks off the pass. Grabs control of it at the point. Fires it on net. Makes the save, but they score! And the power play strikes once again. Well, you know that specialty teams are so critical, James, and they have executed with the player advantage all night long. Edmonton's been the more aggressive team offensively. Look at the shot clock and just look at the score. Florida's on the attack. And that's a great hit some play by Messier. The Oilers are dominating play, and in my opinion, James, this all starts your work away from the puck. When you close quickly, you retrieve it first. They've done an excellent job of that, and it's gone the other way, and they've cashed in. Levels them with the hit. The Oilers have it now. 
Moves the pass in front. Great defensive hits on play to pick it off. Florida's got control of it now from their own end. Kearns plays it along the wall. Dumps it in. Edmonton's got the puck along the boards. Quick pass to Messier. Takes the puck. Takes a shot. And that's deflected off someone in front. Let's it go! Big time stop! Bobrovsky's got the puck and he's gonna hang on. Edmonton's had the better scoring opportunities and lots of them, which is why they lead in a big way here in the second. Quick shot off the draw. And that's turned aside with a glove. Culp's lugging the puck. Here's a short pass to McDonald. Moves the puck. Moves it to Gretzky. And he takes the feed. Takes it into the slot. And he has to wait for more support. Oh, what another stop! You can certainly tell that the goaltender is dialed in on that last sequence of saves, James. He's to position, so he finds a way to make multiple saves back to back. Edmonton's message going into this one when we talked to them at the morning skate was to get a lot of pucks on net. They've done just that, and they lead as a result. Oh, and he put it up and over the net. Now you work so hard to get your eyes on the net. You see some daylight. He goes. Oh! back in their favor. The officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. Fires it into the offensive zone. Quick feed to Kearns. Florida's got the puck in their own end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up Steve. And the puck is scooped up here into the open ice by Corals. Moves it quickly over to Kearns. Moving into the attacking zone. That goes wide. Here's a shot. Shoot, shoot. No signs of slowing down here tonight, especially what they've been doing in the offensive zone. Yeah, why would you slow down when you can pad your stats? I mean, they've been all over the offensive zone. They're having a ton of fun out there, and they're gonna wave right through the bench. And he was locked in on that save as play continues. Bobrovsky's got to make more stops like that, James. He's got to reset the momentum for his team. I mean, it's not about what happened or the present moment. It's about the next save, and that's the key contributor to reset this team and get them moving forward. Edmonton's offense has come to shine here tonight as we look at the score here late in the second. And he takes the feed. Here's the shot. And it's stopped by the glove. Nice play there. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Oh, wow. Stops again. Sends it quickly to Kearns. Here he is. Takes the shot. Denies that opportunity. Takes a couple of knocks. Oh, oh, Edmonton's having a night, as, as some kids might say, Cheryl. They're balling out there here in period number two. Just loving it out here, James. I mean, they have had control of the play. They've been so dominant. It almost feels effortless. And when it feels effortless, you don't want it to stop. And they've got the intermission looming, and you know they want to stay on the ice. And there's the horn bringing it into period number two. Still 20 minutes more of action in the third. Stick around. And they are ready to drop the puck on period number three. Edmonton's won it. Cohen's taking it from his own end. Slides the puck to Street. And now he moves it quickly to Kearns. Picked up by Street. And down he goes as the puck goes free. And he takes a shot. Oh, and he 
have the answer on that one. He's the emotional leader of this team, and he typically scores in this type of situation, but the goaltender shuts the door, and that's key because he's an emotional leader, and you knew if he scored, he was going to generate a ton of energy for his team. Inside the offensive zone. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck now. Gretzky's got the puck in his own zone. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Stop that one. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. The Oilers offense has been the story tonight as they continue to lead big time in the third. Play is back underway. Quick shot on goal. Denied that one. Another one here to the total tonight. What a performance. Yeah, they've had the puck on their stick for a majority of this game. You know the coaching staff is going to be impressed. Hey, maybe they'll get the day off tomorrow. He's stopped by the goaltender. From the back of the cage with the puck. Nearing the point. Oh, he saved it. What a stop. Well, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. Edmonton's looking to break out. And that's just out of reach. Puck grab by Kelsey. Oh, what a save in front. The Oilers played along the boards. And that one stopped. Oh, what a save. Uh, that doesn't swing momentum in your favor. I don't know what will, James. That's a last-ditch effort to make a play. What a beautiful save. The Oilers continue to lead here in the third, listening to their coach's message. Lots of pucks on now. energy that goes throughout this entire lineup when he scores. That's a true testament to his leadership and what he means to this group. Oh, gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. Couldn't catch up to that pass. That knocks him off the puck. Slides it on over to Colt. Quick shot and makes the routine save. Fires it on net. And that's blocked. Takes the puck behind the net. Oh, what a save of the play! Whoa! He's doing absolutely everything he can to keep his team in this game, James. Unbelievable save. Sends a pass over. Shot off the mask! Kept out that way. Well, James, that brings new meaning to putting everything in front of the puck to make a save as it goes off of his mask. Not sure if he's rattled right there, but he shakes it off and he gets the save. Quick pass to Boucher. Complete explosion on that physical hit. He delivers a strong hit there, but they're down in it. He's gone! Off the pipe and the twine! Oh, it's a game of inches, and this time the inches are working his favor. They go right into the net. We see players work on this all the time in practice, James. It's about getting position net front, and then once that puck is coming towards you, you gotta get your hands away from the body with great hand-eye coordination. Just get your stick on it. You're not sure where it's going all the time, but this time, it winds up in the back of the net. Huge steal in his own end. The Panthers take it across the line. Here we go, pucks in deep. Here's a short pass to Bouchard. And he takes the dish. Moves it to Kearns. Florida's got it in the neutral zone. Here's a shot. Sucked down by the blocker. Picked up along the boards by Mahomes. Currents takes it inside his own end. Quick feed to Street. Moves inside. And that goes off a player. Takes the feed from the goaltender. Florida's crossed the line and on the attack. Edmonton's got control of the puck. Change up, change up. Final seconds of this one, and the home fans certainly appreciate that they got their money's worth tonight. Here's 
a chance. Just wide of the net. That's all she wrote for this one. Cheryl, today was about as dominant a performance I've seen from the team all season. Yeah, they held the puck and they had possession time. And what they did with that was really effective. They pulled it in small spaces, draw the coverage to them, open up a lane, and it was off to the races. And the party's not over just yet, Pounder. Look at them. Here they come back out onto the ice. You gotta love it. Just a fun night 